dashes here. He dashes there. He dashes every bloody where. He dashes up. He dashes down. The dash and womble gets all over town. Whoa! Hey everyone, the Raider Dash and Womble here. Yeah? Hope everyone's doing well. Hopefully your weekend is going great. Don't worry about that. Oh, look, look. This is what happens when you work with cards. Every now and again you flip and bash yourself. Well, I do. Anyway, um, things happen. Anyway, uh... First of all, big thank you to one of our uh, fans. I will do a, a better video of this, but I wanted to show you all this. This, I'm going to have to hide. Maybe it won't work that way. Tombstone, Arizona. What a crazy shirt that is. That's came from one of our fans uh, that watches our uh, channel. Myself and Mrs. Womble got one. Big thank you for to Presley for that. Uh, Presley is a uh, fan of the... Uh, apparently some word in the group. Um, fan of the uh, Westerns and lives somewhere near, near this town. Anyway, uh, thank you again, Presley. Very kind of you to do so. Um, but it's a nice shirt too. Very nice. Light pattern on it too. It's very good. And uh, I'll try to get a picture of myself and Mrs. Womble. Because she got a black one. And I got this darkish grey looking thing. Colour. Not sure. Not sure what they called it. But anyway. It looked good. It looks good. It does look good. Anyway, again, thank you, Presley. It's very kind of you. Very, very kind of you to do that. And, um, you know, we just love everybody that hangs out with us, etc. We love the community that we've gotten together with, uh, or that we've become a part of. I mean, there's a lot of people that we, uh, that we see on a daily basis on YouTube. <laughs> And um, it's great fun, great fun hanging out with everybody. Um, today, <laughs> good grief! Today, um, went out the DoorDash. I decided to take the van. I checked it before we left the net. Okay, good. Seemed all right. Oh, by the way, I put my hand as well. Anyway, um, and well, anyway, I was a bit late going out. Later than I thought, actually. But anyway. Because uh, I only just checked it. And, um... But still had some problems with the van. Any, I, I can't flip and go on about the van for now. I've been waiting all day to watch this one video. This one video I've been waiting. I wanted to watch it. Um, at some stage uh, during the evening, but we'd already started watching a uh, uh, a live stream with Mary from Mary's Gigs, and um, but I wanted to watch it, this this particular video um, and focus on that and that alone. I didn't want any any distractions, so I just want to watch this one bloke do this video. Because I've been waiting for him to do, do another video, and holy shit. Because I knew it was going to be funny. I <laughs> Bloody hell, John. You, was, you had no idea how much talent you've got. But first of all, your video editing. But the storytelling. 
<laughs> Holy crap. And then you cheeky sod, you went and put me in it too. I saw that. <laughs> I picked up on that one. <laughs> I didn't kill, but anyway, it's been hilarious. I tell you what, if not, it was absolutely hilarious. I mean, this bloke can tell a story and just make it. it he does door dash in the Uber Eats down in the south, and it is abs he's absolutely funny. So bloody funny, this geezer. He just, um, you have to go watch him. The old driver. I'll put a link down below, of course, and I'll put his banner up here somewhere up. But it's, uh, his latest video, like I said, I've been waiting all day to see this one. I saw it come on and maybe it's just uh, leaving home. For, oof, no, I want to focus on it. Just want to focus on that alone and don't want any other distractions. So it's now like one o'clock in the morning. <laughs> and uh, well, actually, I watched it just a little before that after I'd finished my live show, which I'll tell you about in a minute. But this one bloke, this, oh, you just got to go see his talent. Absolutely. He's a new. He's new to doing uh, video editing, as far as I I recall. Damn, he's flipping good. But his storytelling and and such his humour, bloody hell. <laughs> it's hilarious. It is absolutely. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Mrs. Womble has not seen it yet, but she will be seeing it when I get in and put it on the telly. Because oh gosh. Brilliant, absolutely brilliant. I thoroughly enjoyed it, John. Keep on doing them like that, mate. Just keep on doing them like that. It's bloody hilarious. If people have been say they don't understand the humour, then if you've been idiots, just just keep on doing it. It's absolutely hilarious. Absolutely. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> <laughs> and the, oh, there were so many things in that that I just, ah, oh, my belly was hurting from flipping, rolling up so much. I was laughing, laughing, oh, crying out loud. A tears coming out my eyes. That's why my eye flipping broke open. My feet, I was laughing so hard. After an hour. Oh, gosh. Absolutely hilarious. Go watch him. Whatever you do, I don't even care if you turn my video off now. Just go watch him. Come back later, though. But anyway, go watch him. Ah, oh, Got to. And if you haven't already done so, go like and subscribe to his video, his channel, because you will not be disappointed. This is like a... Uh, Door dashing, door dash, Uber Eats channel and food delivery channel that you have never like that you've never ever seen before, and I'm I'm guarantee you you are going to be it is funny, so so funny, so much talent. Damn, very good there, John. Absolutely enjoyed it. Thoroughly enjoyed it. And I'll be watching it again too. <laughs> it's <coughs> absolutely brilliant. Oh gosh. I can't if you praise you enough for doing that. My name was, that was great. Oh dear. So much. Last time I, I know you work with, work, use it with CapCut. And I've uh, always done my editing on iMovie. That's what I started with, and that's what I still continue with. But I started going on with CapCut and using that to do the editing. And uh, there were so many features on it. Oh, yeah, I wanted to put this on it, and I, I was just messing around. So I was putting a video, different bits on it and playing around. And then I got the some little bomb thing. And I put that on the screen. I thought, I wonder what that do. And I played it back, and boom. 
That was one some some bloody effect, I'll tell you. It blew my bloody been video off the screen. I've not been able to see it. Find it since. <laughs> How you edit it, it, I don't know. But anyhow, it's bloody good at his editing. And bloody good at flipping his, uh, his storytelling. Oh, good grief. Go watch it. You will not be disappointed. At all. Alright, <laughs> I, I had to give myself a rest on that one, um, anyway, um, started a bit later on the, uh, the door dashing for us, it won't be as, as, as exciting as it was for John, or as he can portray his uh, daily shifts, but anyway, um, but yeah, we uh, started about 6.30 uh, when I got some uh, dinner. I should really stop getting dinner before we go, I think. I need to just dive in and get work done and then go get some dinner. Sometimes we do that, but... Anyhow, um, so when I got some dinner, got started with DoorDash. Uh, Mrs. Womble had uh, Mary on the live stream. Um... So we was watching her and doing other things and that. Finally an offer came in. Woohoo. Hmm. I think it was $16 for that one. Yes, it was. $16 and where the bloody hell was that from? Holy crap. I only done two bloody drops. Hell. Because <laughs> last so I've forgotten where I've been. Nah, it wasn't. Anyway. Um... Yeah, I went to Gus's, Gus's World Famous Fried Chicken. I'd never heard of it before, but okay, you reckon you're, you've been world famous. So you are, there's a Brit that knows who you are. Anyhow, um, what's this? I forgot where my shift on my Miley Tracker. Oops, go off of that. Anyway, um... Yeah, so I went off and did that one. It weren't going all that far away. I think seven or eight miles. And it was paying $16. And I uh, went off and delivered that. Didn't have a problem. Oh, no, I went straight into uh, Gus's. I had it ready. Came out. It's all... A, for me, it's all a bit of a, a confusion. So many bloody things going on. Um... We, uh, we was trying to get on to doing a, a live stream with, with Mary. But I couldn't do it at the time because I was going off on this delivery. She was trying to find a link to do it anyway. And there was all sorts going on now. I had the, the uh, directions on. Give me directions where I was going on the customer. Mrs. Womble's got her phone on reading all the stuff on there. What's going on. And portraying, conveying that to me because I can hardly read it when I'm going down the road. Plus the bloody sun visor is on, on, on it as well, so it's uh, obscuring some of it. Anyway, uh, so for me, my flipping, and I was watching the the gauge, the temperature gauge on the van, because that's like going up a little bit more, and uh, so I was a little bit worried about that. And, it was just uh, too much to take on today. Too much at times. Anyway, went off and delivered that one. Easy delivery. I, no, I didn't even notice it at the beginning. I just went and looked at their, their uh, porch. They were at the drop-off point, And there was a sign that's partially obscured when I took the picture. But I wish I'd looked at it a bit better when I got there. But anyway... Um, I think because when I went up there, where did that bastard thing go? Oh, that came here. That came to Raytown, didn't it, that one? Anyway, um, when we got to the home, nice homes and that, along that street. But uh, oh, there's a bunch of steps. I ended up going up the grass for the most part of it, alongside of it. Street. And it was out there then. Anyhow, I finally got to the top and uh, took the picture when I got it on the doorstep, obviously. 
and then took partially some of the steps going down finally I just went down the grass Whew. I was worn out not as worn out as John on all, on, his, on all the steps he had to do on his video but you'll see that or you should have seen it by now if you turned off when I said <laughs> but anyway um but yeah, got on, got that all, all sorted and uh, headed back to uh, Lee Summit area. I actually got kicked off because uh, it all went grey. Hmm. Anyway, but we got back on and uh, went back to Lee Summit. Um, who was we? When that other one come in? Anyhow, I think I was over by Jason's Deli and then uh, this other job came in and... Fucking strolled on. Where did that go from? Third Street Social, that's right, had to go there. It was paying eleven dollars and I'm gonna say that it was four or five miles away, I don't know. But anyway, it wasn't going all that far to be fair. Anyway, it might have been six miles. Either way, it was it was fine. Went over the Third Street Social. Oh, my gosh. Now, remember, remember, I'm already bloody confused at all what's going on. All right, I've got the live stream. Now we're on the live stream with Mary. So I've got that. I've got that one on loud, so Mrs. Womble can hear it. Uh, she's reading off, off all the comments on her phone. So I've got her going on. I've got the direction thing going on, but I don't really need it because I know where the bloody hell I'm going. But, so I've turned that down. And then we get down to downtown Lee Summit and there's a bloody band that was making an absolute sodding racket at um, Lou Ellen's. <coughs> the unauthentic Irish pub. Anyway, um... What's an absolute racket? Anyway, I pull into the car park. There's so much going on. <coughs> I've got this cough. I don't know where this bloody cough come. And uh, anyway, I go in into uh, Third Street Social, and it was good. Dude. I mean, it was girl came over, receptionist came over, showed her, told her who I was for. She went off, came back, been She's got it all already. Oh, thank you very much. Bye. And um, I was off out the door. And the only thing was that pissed me off is, is uh, I don't know if they're doing it at certain restaurants or what. But I got it in the catering bag, I thought. It wasn't a catering order, but it, it, it just seemed to be an easier option to put it in there because Mrs. Womble's got a few opinions phones and all sorts of things going on over there so i put it in there and uh i got back in the driver's seat all nice everything's all settled in the back and it pops on pull pulls up for the next one i've got the vipping item and it says to me got the food rather clicks on to that i've confirmed that i picked it up now it wants me to bloody will take a picture of the seat <sighs> are you flipping kidding me <laughs> why do <all> this? Why? <laughs> why in the bloody hell do you want me to do this? Why don't you ask that when I'm at the fucking business? <sighs> so I'll get back out, take a picture of the bloody receipt, okay? And it's not fifth and taking it. Why are you not bloody taking it? It's not fucking having it. Finally, ripping it gets, it, it takes it. Mm. Confirm that it's all correct. Yes. That's the bloody receipt. Think. I'm not going through the people's food, you stupid thing. This is what the restaurant should do. They've got the order. They deal with the food. They can get their dirty pinkies in it. I'm not doing it. Anyway, um... Took the bloody picture, zipped it back up in the bag, and headed off to the customer. On the way over to the customer, I've had to go down 50 highway, and 
rain sweeping, temperature sweeping going up. <coughs> oh shit, not now. Not now. <sighs> Anyhow, I watched it creeping up and creeping up. It gets off to the customer. I guess it didn't like it going down the motorway because it was going a bit quicker than what I had been doing. Anyhow, gets it to uh, customer's house and I turn it off. I didn't even mow it to park on their driveway. And uh, walks up their driveway, puts the thing on their doorstep, take a picture, walking off. And I, the uh, restaurant, they should flip in tight or see all these bags because it'll top it out a little bit. There was just some plastic cutlery that they put in there and that'll top that had toppled out the bag so uh put all that back in there but i wish they would seal the bags gussie's always seal the bags i'd flipping love it going to gussie's they seal the bags everything is done in there and you can see what's in there so why any other place can't do that i don't know but anyhow and Third Street Social, well, bloody hell, it was an arm and a leg to go to that place. They should do it like that. Anyhow, um, got that delivered, took a picture of it. I was halfway down their driveway and a lady came out and said, thank you. Got back to the van and uh, started it up and went, right, OK, I've had enough. This is the end of the night. I don't want to play this bloody game anymore. So we didn't do a whole lot um, at all. I went off down to uh, Casey's and uh, their petrol might be cheaper, but their flipping coolant isn't. Whew. Bloody expensive, dear. Anyhow, um, got down there and uh, waited a few minutes. Uh, probably about 10, 15 minutes. And then uh, wait for it to cool down a tad and bought some new cool more coolant i went in there for a pit stop as well and then uh um got the coolant in thereafter the expensive coolant but yeah it was i wonder if i could have got a cash back on that thing going to casey's i think i can get that on the the dasher direct card Anyway, anyhow, so yeah, so got all that done, uh, put all that in, and uh, edit towards home, stops a quick trip along the way, still doing his live stream all the way, and uh, Mary's gone home by now, so we've got to see uh, see her little cat, Howard, he was walks, walking around, seeing what's all going on, and uh, got to see him on camera, <laughs> he loved little cat. Just wandering around. <laughs> Always love seeing the cats. Anyway, um, and if you've not seen Howard, Howard, link will be down below. He's got his own channel. His own channel. One day he'll go live on his channel. They'll call it the Meow Mix. That's what it be. <laughs> I just come out with that. That's funny. Anyway, uh, um, so... Yeah, definitely go watch how I love a little kitty cat. Goes out for a walk. He's got his own look, got his lead, and he goes out and walks, goes off for walkies. If I'd done try to do that with my cat, he would have lassoed me and taken me for a bloody walk. <laughs> he would not have had that. He couldn't even put a birthday out on that little, but you know, little kit without getting a funny look. Mm. Anyway, um, so that was it really. I came home and uh, did uh, done a live stream of myself along the way because uh, Mary, uh, you know, she's been working a long time today. Or yesterday's it would be now. So she needed to go get some kip as well, get, get some rest. And, uh, yeah, just... Uh, done a uh, live stream along the way I, didn't I just switched it on I didn't really tell anyone until we actually made it home but, but anyway I uh, was on there for a little while and spoke to uh, Eric from the Stardashians 
if uh, you haven't seen them, again, their link will be down below. Um, and their banner will be somewhere up here. But it, we've got a good community of people, people that are looking uh, out to uh, try and uh, help people uh, succeed in this, uh, in this YouTube and stuff. Try and help people along the way. Uh, it's like when we was on um, uh, Mary's channel, not last night, but the night before, I suppose it would be now Friday night. And uh, there was a, I was helping her try to uh, clear, get some more storage and such in her phone and clear off the old crap that's in there. I mean, I do it every day on my phones. Get rid of the old uh, um, email, uh, text messages as well. Get rid of all that. Uh, um, which you should do every day. Get rid of all the all the data, all the uh, browser data, etc. Get rid of it all because you don't. It just fills up your phone, and all those little tabs that you keep flipping, coming up with. Like, let me bring up this one. I don't know. Uh, okay, so you got this, and then you go up here, and then you got all these that are open. Look, all those are open. So just knock them out of the way. Clear it out. Don't need it. You can always go back on it all. Just clear it all out. It all helps to uh, clear, keep your phone cleared up. How come what? Some people are just not for it with the real world. Real world. Anyway, um, so that was it, really. That was the end of the night. We just uh, was on with Stardashian, and then uh, a fella from um, that lives out in Northern California came on, and we were chatting with him as well. And um, yeah, it was fun. I mean, I just the community that we've got. It's just a community of people that just want to help each other. It's good. It's really all we should do. It was like when I started my business doing all the websites and such. It's bloody hard to get started. If you don't know what you're doing, it's bloody hard. The same with if you've been doing uh, YouTube and such. Well, first of all, you've got to uh, make the first step or three to actually start doing a video, I mean, you can actually just carry on thinking about it as much as you like. How am I going to approach it? And all that business. Well, let's just jump in and be yourself. Just be yourself. Look at John. John from Vipin, uh, the old driver. Oh, good grief. Such a funny bloke. Just be yourself. Just be yourself. That's all people want to see. I mean, they don't want to go on there and see some ignorant twat being a flipping, trying to be a gangster or whatever. There's a few of those on there that are absolute flipping idiots. But don't, you've been, you don't want to see that. You don't want to see that. Just go on there, have a laugh. Just have fun with it, for crying out loud. The more you have fun and the more that you, you are, be who you really are, the more you will convey that to your audience. And the more your audience flipping sees how much fun you are, John, <laughs> the more people you will get to your uh, your um, channel. Not only John, I mean everybody that just bees themselves. Just have a laugh with it. Have a laugh with it. I mean, I know I can be in a new and obnoxious little git. Uh oh, did the house flipping blow up across the road? That would be handy. Anyway, um, <laughs> it's a drug house. Oh gosh, well, there's no fire from it. Let's see, mate, no fire from it. As you may recall, 
a few weeks ago while I was doing a live stream. There was lots of pop, 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 pop. Apparently some people that watch my videos don't know what pop, pop, pop means, but it's been gunfire. At least 12 gunfire. And it was right over there. It was someone got shot. One of the druggies. That must have been something, some flipping bad shot that flipping done that. 12 shots and it didn't even, anyway. Um, and yeah, called the cops on that one. We could hear the whoever it was out there if you've been crying and whining, but bollocks. If you sell drugs and you're two doors away from a hippie preschool, then I don't care if you've been if you've been shot or not. Anyhow, I know it's not not hippie the way to be, but if they're willing to fip in, put stuff like that in the hands of kids, then I don't really give a flying shot what happened to you. <laughs> as long as you fip in, keep it all over there. And yeah, <laughs> on a joyous note, been just, like I was saying, just have fun with being, doing the videos. Just be yourself. And if there's something you don't know, you know, ask. Just ask. I mean, there's a lot of people in our community that were quite flipping happy to flipping tell you, or inform you, or um, give you some advice or whatever. This is how we do it. I mean, it's up to you how you do it, but this is how we do, do it. Oh, if you need certain bags or whatever, drink bags or pizza bags or whatever it is, we'll let you know where, where we got ours from and where you should go try. Um, you know, I don't know. All we can do is to help one another. If we can do that, have a few laughs, then let's just do that. That's all we want. We don't necessarily have to be talking about bloody uh, work all the time. But, you know, learn. Just learn from each other and have a few laughs along the way. And, uh, and again, don't forget, go see John. If you want some laughs, go see John at, at uh, the old driver. And you can see him make fun of me going, I saw that. <laughs> That's okay. But I don't care because it was funny. Anyway. <laughs> Anyhow, everybody, I think that will do it. I've rattled on enough. Um, and um, I'll be back. Hopefully uh, you all have a wonderful rest of your weekend. Hopefully you get to see this before the end of the weekend, otherwise it won't make any bloody sense. I said, hope you had a good weekend. Anyway, um, and don't forget, big thank you to our, one of our fans, Mr. Presley. No, not Elvis. But anyway, um, <laughs> thank you again and uh, very much appreciated. And if any of you want merchandise from the Mist from Dash and Womble, I do have a link on my uh, um, main channel page. Anyway, thanks for popping up by. Thanks for popping by, everybody. And um, you know, it's greatly appreciated that you all come along and watch this daft old geezer rattle on about who knows what. And uh, Anyway, thanks for popping by. Cheers. Ta-da.